Hi guys, so I'm walking to the bus stop. I just got done with my BLS certification, which I need for work. So I'm um, using now my work bag that I will shoot later. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna share to you guys the stuff that I have in my work bag as a newly hired registered nurse. So most of the stuff that I got are from Amazon. So I will put that link in the description box below so you can check it if you're interested. I've been using this rebook bag for like a year and two months now when I started my job as a caregiver. So, yep, I got this from Marshalls for like $13. I forgot, but I know it's below $15. So, yep, and now that I'm already a nurse, so it's time for an upgrade, guys. So, yeah. And for my scrubs, I've been using the Gachi brand from Amazon. It's cheap. You can buy it as a pair for like $22, $23. I know it's below $25. If you're looking for a scrub that lasts long and has a good quality and it's not pricey, I highly recommend that, guys. I'll put that in the description box below if you want to check that out. And yeah, let's move on to what's in my bag. So first things first is, of course, my bag, which, as you can see, I got it from Lululemon. I got this cute Jigglypuff coin purse from Levi's. They have this collaboration Pokemon X Levi's. So I said, oh my god, Jigglypuff is my favorite Pokemon character. So when I first saw this, I was like, oh my god, I need to buy that. And I said, okay, I'll just put it as a bling for my work bag. And I just realized this will come handy because I can put like coins and like dollar bills for the homeless people that I want to give money to because I don't feel safe if I get it from my main purse just because maybe they're just gonna try to like steal the whole purse so I was like okay maybe I'll just put all my donation money here so every time I see homeless people and then I just like really grab some dollars here I got that cute pin from Amazon so I put the pin in front of my bag just for a decoration and now let's go to the inside of the bag so first things first is i got a mini pockets on the sides and i got a water bottle holder i will flash a picture right here guys so you can see that so in the first mini pocket is i got an n95 mask just in case i need it or like if i lose my mouse or like whatever i have extra here that i can just like grab anytime and then another stuff that i have in this pocket is my charger and power bank so i always carry a power bank with me guys everywhere i go and i always make sure that it's fully charged before i leave the house because it's really important especially me that i'm always on my phone i'm always checking social media this is always going to be in my work bag so that's it in the first pouch on the other side of the pouch is of course i got my airpods and i got some pens so in my entire nursing career in the philippines i always use this g tech brand 0.4.3 when i do charting but here in the u.s i think it's all in the computer or tablet so i kind of just want to have a pen in my bag for notes if ever i want to like write down something and i got some highlighters the bic i got blue and light green and another thing is of course my keys for our condo so i have an air tag attached to it and the customized one that i have in my previous video so it says cami in there so there's like two mini pouches on the front and on the other pouch i got my pepper spray so right now that i'm still traveling through public transportation yeah i always carry pepper spray with me every time especially with the hate crime going on you'll never know when you need it and then that's it for the small pouches now let's go to the main so first things first is i have my water bottle i use the peach bounce i use this for my gym i use this for work because i can literally put everything here and then it stays cold for like 
hours. Love this one. Beach Bounce and it's so decent. It fits on my bag perfectly. And the next one is I have antibacterial wipes because I'm so OCD with my phone, AirPods, my Apple Watch, and my bracelet. I always clean them before I go inside my house just because yeah I'm in the public transportation and you know especially but I'm gonna start working in the hospital so there's a lot of germs right there guys so yep I always carry a antibacterial wipes with me and the next one is I have an extra compression sock I don't know, I just want to bring an extra one in case I need it. So I got this from Fig, as mentioned in my previous video. It's really nice. I like the design of this one. Hit me with your best shot. And I have this cute mermaid-like notebook. Take me to Neverland. It's just like a normal notebook. It's not a planner or anything like that. I just want to use this in case. Yeah, as mentioned, I, I bought a pen with me to like write notes, especially with the hospital protocols. Stuff that I need to remember maybe for endorsement, documentation, because of course every hospital is different with their rules so i just want to kind of take notes with that so just i don't forget and then yeah i can just browse all through it like every time i need it and the next one guys is scrub cap so i don't know maybe i need it maybe i don't but i just want to be like prepared so i got this from figs the next thing i have is <laughs> naproxen Sodium, so I get casual headaches every time. This is the only OTC pain meds that really works like in 30 minutes. So that's why I got a whole bunch of it from CVS. So yeah, you'll never know when you get the headaches and you don't want any of that on your 12 hour shift or 8 hour shift or whatsoever because yeah. You have patients to take care of, so you can't be your own patient. And the next one, so this is a hand cream because of course you always gotta wash your hands, you always put sanitizer on and winter is coming so definitely you need this hand cream. And then next one guys, so I got some white board markers, erasable ones, so I got a lot of colors. I don't know, maybe my hospital will require it maybe not but i just got it just to like be prepared if ever i'm gonna be like writing something on a whiteboard so yeah i have my own and the next one is of course i have my sanitizer for obvious reasons and i have my of course purse with me or my wallet usually like small ones I think I'm already like done with a big wallet so just to like keep all my IDs and credit cards in here and with my purse I have another air tag just to like locate it if someone steals it or whatever and the next one guys is I have a taser so I feel like pepper spray is not enough so I got a taser so tasers here in PA is legal if you just use it of course for your own protection so the next one is I have scrunchies this is from Gymshark I have the peach and green one in case I'll lose I, I usually just put my lululemon hair tie here but this is overused so I kind of like replace this with Gymshark so yeah and of course with the scrunchies and hair tie you need your hairbrush but I don't really like hairbrush so I always carry comb I'm gonna just like always make sure that your hair is not on the way especially when you're doing sterile procedures so yep so I got the lidocaine pain relief cream of course for obvious reasons I got my Ray-Bans in here and I have this <laughs> Ice Breakers Duo. I love this. I just discovered this thanks to my brother-in-law Tyler and I really like it. So it's strawberry and cool mint. So if you're gonna like work for 12 hours, of course you don't have like the best breath. So this will come in handy especially when you do your endorsement. So yep. Just, just gonna bring some. And the next one, guys, is of course snacks. I have my protein bar. 
from PE Select and I have this Ritz crackers. I like this. You'll never know. You're really busy and you can't just spare 15 minutes to eat your lunch. That's why you gotta always bring your snacks. One thing you'll never want on your ship is to be hypoglycemic, trust me. So I have this one. I got this from Amazon again. This is my lunch bag, so nice. It's waterproof. And of course, we Filipinos, we always eat rice with viands. So I don't want that to spill on my little lemon bag. So I got this. I will put my Ziploc containers or like my Tupperwares here, my fruit. I will throw all my lunch here and just kind of like fold it like that. It's so handy. It's foldable. And the next one is I got this. I protection it's really cute it's in my favorite color it looks like kind of pink but i know it's purple so it's a blue light blocking glasses so at the same time if i'll be working in the icu so there's gonna be a lot of documentation guys and just you're just gonna like be on the screen always so this is a good thing to use and also this is an eye protection if you're dealing with patients that you think that will have flashy bloody fluids so this is a really good thing you can use it's protected on the top and on the side if you have your mask on with this glasses it doesn't fog so that's one thing it's like three in one for your protection for blue light blocking and then for like the anti-fog thing and i have my umbrella of course i got this for my mother-in-law christmas gift last christmas so you'll never know when it's gonna rain so you always gonna bring an umbrella so i just got the black so it matches my lululemon bag and inside is of course you all know what's inside right the main paraphernalia is that you use as a nurse because the other stuff are just mainly for like your personal stuff so what i got here is i got my course scissors for obvious reasons you really gotta have your scissors with you all the time and i do have my pen light here actually i have two so i have the rose gold and black and what i love about this is they have the pupil sizes for your reference literally i just unboxed this so i still have their triple a batteries right here and i have my badge for my id right here so it just says cami daily and purple heart of course my favorite color and then has an art and sign on it so it's really cute and of course every nurses you gotta have your own stethoscope this is just the litman classic 3 as you can see on my previous video but i got the new stethoscope tag here that's the same design with my id badge and pretty much that's it guys for my what's in my work bag yeah i kind of have a lot of things for sure there's gonna be some additional stuff that will throw in this bag when i start working so i will make an updated video maybe four to six months from now and then yeah I'll see you guys on my next video. See ya!